Hello and welcome to another edition of Beer Dad's Beer Reviews. We are going to do another beer from Asvex, another one of their newish releases. Um, this is Inflatable Shark. It's a pale ale and it is a collaboration with um, Lake Bruco up in Kendall, I think, the Lake District, and a uh, Brahas Hops or Brahas, yeah, Brahas, uh, Brahas X Hops. This is hopped with Nectaron um, and Brathas Citrus Spectrum. I say it's 4.6% ABV. Have a little look at this canard. Like something out of the old uh, Sea Life Centre. Um, I generally thought I'd done this beer that I found it in the cupboard. Um, this was canned on the 1st of August 2024, that's for the 1st of May 2025, as canned number 240. Those of you who are interested, and it cost me four nicker out of Barton's in Ashton Makefield, or four ten the local. I am um, again. It just appears that I'm doing a lot more as of peers than anything else. I've enjoyed every one. Don't get me wrong. Right, let's just pop a top on this. See what we've got. So we just remove that sticker. Put that there, and I think of the latest releases. Up until the of this video, I think I, the only one I haven't done is Demon Engine. So I'm not sure when you're going to see this video. It could be towards the end of September. This one, this one is a one of the pre-recorded ones. Um, so beer and glass, what have we got? We've got a one finger, density packed white head. Beer itself is a lovely, um, hazy orange colour. I am. Um, it looks lovely, it really does, but then, let's be honest, so do most of the Asvex beers, they really do look great. Um, is it the nose so we can smell? Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. Citrus all over the place here. That next one really shines. Yeah, citrus, zesty, pithy. The citrus comes through as well, but it gives it, it also gives it a bit of a, a bit like an, like an earthy note to it. it. Smells great. Let's go for the body and carbonation. Cheers. That's really nice. That's really nice. The body is light. Um, Carbonation is, is, is light and it's, it's soft. You can tell it's a pale ale. You can tell it's like it's 4.6%. Um, the flavours are at that level. Um, but they're still really good. Right, so let's go for the big taste. Cheers, everybody. You know what? It's very nice. It's very nice. It is, as I say, light in flavour, light citrus, light zest, light pith, um, there's a, a dry finish, and that's really nice, that's very, very good. Um, I would like this to be jacked up to a 6.5%, maybe even to push it into that double area of 8, I think it'll be absolutely beautiful, I mean, it's really good, but I think it could be... It could be superb. Um, yeah, it's decent. Pale ales aren't my thing. But I can session a few of these quite happily, quite easily, watching some football, watching some sport. Just having it with a with a maybe having it with a, a, a bit of something to eat. Yeah, it's, it's decent. So this is Asvex Lakes Bruco, who I, I, again I don't do enough of. Um, Lakes Bruco and Brafhas Hops. This is a visible shark pale ale, 4.6% ABV. Do I like it? Yes. Would I buy it again? Yes. Would I have to friends? Yes. It's very nice. I've got a few mates who like pale ale, so this is right up the street. If you've had this beer, let me know what you think. Put a little comment in. Do you like that video? Do that if you don't. Subscribe down there. I know it's a short video, but there's not much more you can say about the beer than what I have. Hell yeah.